Three fires in Whitman County have burned more than 20,000 acres since Labor Day, leaving so much destruction. Our Morgan Trow went to the small town of Rosalia, where volunteers are helping victims of the Malden and Pine City fires. The wildfires destroyed the towns of Malden and Pine City, leaving many people without homes or a source of food. But this truck drove in to give some people their first hot meal in days. All right, Joelle. Things like this happen. This is life. And if we were worth a damn as a species, we'd go, let me help you. Bill Basham owns Open Range Food Truck. He got an anonymous donation last night to bring over 150 meals to the residents of Malden and Pine City. And he knew the hour long drive was worth it to help those people who were suffering. We went back and I just stood there and cried all I could do. Mm -hmm. Everything's gone. We've lost everything. Pine City residents Cynthia and Markham Campbell lost their home, pets, ashes of family members, vehicles, and their memories in the wildfires. They are saying they are surviving through prayer, and as they came to their church today, they were hoping for a sign, one that Basha might not even realize he showed. It shows the grace of God. Peace. It's helped us a lot. Although we've lost a lot, we have still been blessed. It's a game changer. Rosalia Assembly of God Pastor is feeling thankful for the food truck for coming into his community. He's also been organizing drives for those affected by the wildfires. And having hot food today has helped those who no longer have it. But also for his volunteers who are working tirelessly to help get people back on their feet. And it's just overwhelming how, how the response has been. And it gives me faith in humanity again. This has made a huge difference, huge difference. People's lives are being changed because of their generosity. But we'll feed until we run out of food or money. People need help right now, and let's do it. Open Range is hoping this will be the start of a new trend, with people donating restaurant services to come out to Whitman County. But if you have any supplies that you wish to donate to the church, all of that information can be found on our website at creme.com. Reporting in Rosalia, Morgan Trow, Creme 2 News. And another great update to share with you. We're learning tonight that No Light Brew House has helped raise $29,000 for the families of Pine City and Malden. Their goal is to reach $50,000 for the fire relief fund. To donate, they ask that you send payments to their address there, and that location is there on your screen. Love to see what people are doing to help our neighbors.